Hey y'all, welcome to my kitchen. Uh, I'm gonna do dirty water dogs. Well, sort of, kinda. Um, people kind of look at me strange when I say dirty water dogs. When you're up in New York, Philadelphia area, you get a hot dog from a cart. They've been sitting in water that's been simmering. Uh, you know, just blow boil or whatever, just sitting in hot water. And uh, they call them dirty water dogs. They used to get them a lot after parades and whatnot when I was with the fire department, first aid. Um, down here, you don't get dirty water dogs. When you go to a hot dog cart down here, you get a cart, you get a, a hot dog that's been thrown on the grill. I, I, I can't imagine that. I mean, they're good, don't get me wrong. It's, it's you know, it's a decent hot dog. But you're sitting down in a, uh, you know, it's a hundred, it's a hundred degrees with 98 percent, 99 percent humidity here in Florida, and you're going to cook a hot dog over a grill when you could have it sitting in a simmering pan of water. I just don't really get it. But I ain't out there doing it. Basically, what I'm going to do, I got a little pan of water over here, getting ready to. I turned on the heat. Now. I don't know if they do this up there or not. It doesn't really matter because this is how I do it. You know, all them people out there, it's like, that's not how you do it. Well, yeah, it is. You see me doing it this way. This is how I do it. Might not be the way you do it, but it's definitely the way I do it. Well, I don't need a whole lot. I'll worry about that in a little bit. Clean these up some. They didn't take the root off. We'll take the root off of there. That will go in the compost. And take the root off there. And that will go in compost. I hope this is all in view. Uh, I really got to use this onion up. So, just a couple little slices, like so. I'm going to put this over here in that water. You can hear my Pennsylvania, New Jersey right there in that water, can't you? Anyway, I got these beef and cheddar franks. I think I'll throw in about four of those. about like that and we'll let them come up to temperature. I've also got this Gwaltney beef hot dog chili. I've actually got a bunch of these my daughter gave me. Um, she gets them down at her work. So I haven't tried them yet. I'm going to try this. I'm going to try it on top of the hot dog and uh, we'll see how, how it tastes. So I'm just going to pop this in the microwave doesn't really give heating directions. Remove chili from package. Heat in a pan. Slowly adding water until desired consistency is reached. Heat to about 165. Alright. That tells me I can use it. I can put it in a microwave. So that's what I intend to do. I guess I can show y'all. That's what they look like right now. And I'll bring them up to a up to a simmer, and then let them sit or come bring up to a boil, and then let them simmer for a little while. And then I'll cook up this chili, and I'll make up some chili dogs, and I'll show y'all what I got going. All right, y'all, we back now. Like I said, I put this chili in the microwave added about three tablespoons of water to it and it's it's kind of thick and pasty kind of rather good chili taste 
Doesn't have any real heat to it. But that's okay. So, let's get down here. We're going to build, build me a couple of hot dogs. First things first, I got some of this Tostitos Smooth Cheesy Dip. This is nacho dip or anything. This is just cheese. Put a nice smear of that on. Like that. Now I could have grated up some cheese or whatever, but they decided not to do that. And there's some of this mustard. If you follow along, I'm pretty sure I got this at Dollar Tree. A little mustard on there like that. Like that and like so. Now. I need a hot dog. And I need another hot dog. Oh, beef and cheddar oozing right on out of there. I need a couple three jalapenos. I think I'm going to take a picture. Take a picture of that with a different camera. Wonder if I can get any of these onioned out. Yeah, there we go. Put a couple onions on it. I cooked them right. May as well use them. I want them to go bad. It means I need a different picture. So, see, we'll organize just a little bit. Get over here and take a picture. Yeah, maybe that didn't turn out. A little too close. Try that one. That's better. Uh. Excuse me. It's hot in here. Guess y'all want to see me try this, huh? Y'all want to see me make a mess on my beers, which y'all want. pretty good there you go folks my version of a dirty water chili dog uh, thank y'all for taking time to stop by see what it is I'm up to 
If you would, leave me a, a thumbs up, thumbs down, comment. Um, I try to answer all comments. Sometimes I can't find them, apparently. But I do try. And, uh, yeah, subscribe if you haven't. If you have, howdy, 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 thank you all. And until I see y'all again, slaunch y'all. Bye-bye.